Ooh, I be, I'm on that raw chocolate now? Um, we bought raw chocolate from Vita Costa. Plant? What? That's just a cocoa plant? It's, it's ground, it's cacao powder and, cacao. Uh, and raw agave. Cacao. And they lay it in a little tray and they, they cool it and then it becomes almost like a little cool, cold brownie. Cacao is my delicious. soccer Cacao and is my soccer name. And it's raw and it's full of nutrients. Cacao? That's what they call me, that's my nickname. Cacao! Yeah. Cacao. Yeah. From Brazil. Mine is just cow. Mm, not as flattering. <laughs> yeah. But, you know. Cock. Yeah. Equally eyebrow raising. <laughs> yeah. And Matt's is just cock. Cock? Yep. Cock, cow, and cacao. Cock, cow, and cacao. Oh, hey, welcome go. to Table Talk, that show on the internet where we answer your topics and questions via the hashtag Table Talk and the Reddit slash r slash source fed. I'm Matt Lieberman. I'm Brie Esrig. I'm Ricky. Yeah, and hey, this episode is brought to you by our friends at Squarespace. Squarespace, of course, is the number one place when you want to go make your own website. So many people here have made them, uh, and and you know, it's just eight dollars a month. That's nothing. That's How less much? than Netflix. That's less than Netflix. Eight dollars a month. Holy That's balls. less than a merch box. <laughs> That's oh. true. And if you pay for a whole year in advance, you get a domain name absolutely free. You can get ten percent off your order by going to squarespace.com/tabletalk today and use the uh, the offer code TT for 10% off your first purchase, okay? Yay! Squarespace, you should. You, you just should. It's if I pick the first topic, to I know they're gonna, it's gonna distract from me getting the nuts out of my teeth. Ooh. Oh! Double on top. I didn't mean that as like a thick. Nope, it is, is there. Do you right. think We're that, setting it up right. We're do you think this that scrotum right. has ever gotten caught between two a person's two teeth? Yeah, a gap tooth, for sure. Well, a non-gap tooth, like a regular tooth. For sure. Owen is if nodding you, vigorously, which says to me that of, there is a story. I wouldn't think so. If you suck on that hard enough. Yeah. If you can think of it, it's, it's happened. It's happened. Yeah. <laughs> That's gotta be a gap. Hang on, let's just real quick before, I'm sorry. That's real a quote. Quick, real quick, before, because the, the, the scrote, there's some skin, but then right? you, you, to get stuck, it has to, to fold, which makes it, Girthier, and then those, those folds gotta go in the, the tooth. I'm gonna Listen, throw the you, fuck like, up right you now. Are, like a piece of oh, you floss? are overthinking like it. Floss? No, we're I'm talking about up. a sack descending from above. Oh, like a tea bag. <laughs> yeah. What's the first topic, the Bree? The first topic comes from maybe Mackenzie on Reddit. Most people have favorite colors, but what is your least favorite color? Ooh. Thank you. Ooh. Uh, just by name only, color? puce. Ew. That's Puce a color? Is, is a, is a what color. What does that resemble? It's kind of like a raisiny color, as far as I'm aware. It's somewhere between a Puce. purple and a brown. You I almost, am colorblind, you almost so made don't your Puce over judge there with me, that one. okay? Puce, Puce is Puce. Puce. There That's we go. Puce? Kenny, Kenny, can you bring that on screen, please? Can you bring that on camera so people hand, can see the hand puce? It, hand it in here. Bring it bring it over. Or, or get on camera oh, yourself. Yeah. This, is call, Kenny. this is Kenny. This is Kenny. What up, Ken? Yeah. All right, That's so cute. this is puce. Tilt it. I thought that, that was called roll. ass plum. <laughs> no, 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 no. Ass plum uh, is more vibrant. Oh, okay. Yeah, puce is kind of more like like pale. It's like the it's nice color. color. It's the like the color awful. of a vomited up Slurpee. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Like, like Pepto Bismol puke. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Have you yeah. ever puked up Pepto Bismol? All the no, time. But I've Wait, actually? That. No. Oh, okay. No. I have. It's not fun. It turns your stool. You it turns your stool yeah. dark. That's how you know it's and working. And your tongue black because the bile comes up. Your tongue right? comes out black. Yeah. Like a giraffe. Yeah, like a, giraffe. like a giraffe's yeah. tongue. Just covered in bile. It's so cute. Bile. Mm -hmm. that's so a, cute. That's a weird word. Ricky, um, what's your least favorite color? My least favorite color. Um, I don't know. Red stains on green pants. That's, oh yeah, that's not a that's not, not a good great color. One. I just realized that from our uh, from our shoot the other day. Oh mm -hmm. sure. Shoot, but that's okay. I, I I I don't know. We all suffer for our art, don't we? Right? We do. Yeah. We do. Beauty is pain. Mm -hmm. One time I was on set and the makeup artist splattered fake blood all over my favorite cramps shirt, <gasps> and I. You love the cramps. You Lost the cramps. my shit. Yeah, he loves the cramps. No I shit. still have that shirt. I still wear it all the time, Damn. even though it's ruined. It's not pristine, yeah. no mo. It was for the principal. You had yeah. to. And I was an extra in that shoot. Oh, oh. it's even I worse. I suffered it for my art. It didn't, oh, God, even, it didn't even get. You were an under five liner with that shirt. That's no bueno. Yeah. My favorite least color? favorite. Least favorite color. What's your least favorite color? Excuse well, me. If that burp were a color, it'd be my yeah. Yeah. really least favorite, probably. That you. was like a Rick and Morty burp. That a was like bit. a mid-sentence burp. That was guttural. Was <gasps> that was so close. Did you get it? No, 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 no. no. It was, she hit like the sound recorder. Sorry. Sorry. My least it's, favorite color, guys. So few of them hit the camera nowadays. I know, that was that's exciting. why I got a little, little half shove there. Alicia hit it the other day. What? Did she? Yeah. Let's cut time. to a clip. Let's cut to a clip. Let her fly. Oh! And we're back. So. Okay, least favorite color. Gray, grige. 
Grigio? Okay, Grigio. What are all you these mean the words? color of like Pinot Grigio? No. I feel like no, such no, no, a no, no, premium. No. I don't know any of this. It's like let a pale, expl- buttery yellow? Girl, let me explain to you. Okay. It's gray and beige. And that was like a popular Ooh, color in the beige. fashion world like two years ago. Ooh, it was called Grige. It's like and slight. it made me want to throw up. Why wouldn't it be called Grige? It's like a sepia gray. It's Grige. But it's like gray and beige. Sepia it doesn't gray. make any sense. You'd call it Grige. Does fashion make sense to you? No, they're leather Sometimes. jogging pants. <laughs> Thank that's, you. That's where he comes with that. Thank you very much. No, Choose the, the next topic, Matt, because okay. you make sense. All right. Well, that's well. That's kind of. <laughs> uh, all right. Let's see what we got. Yeah. <clears throat> plays with mooses. Mm. I believe it would be plays with moose. If I'm. That would make sense. That would make more sense. Yep. Uh, <laughs> worst roommate slash housemate experience. My old roommate was a drug dealer without me knowing and almost got me shot. Ooh, that would be the worst. That everything really everything we say is lame. <laughs> yeah, after, after that, that, it's like mm. way to throw down the gauntlet, almost getting shot. Now I feel like I have to make one up. No, you don't have to make one up. I'm sure you got a bad roommate. How many yes. times have you guys had a gun to your head, like a real one? Never in my never goddamn in my life, life. Really? Really? Yeah. That's well, never how happened. Many how many times have you had a gun to your head? Uh, four. Four? Mm-hmm. Wait a minute, no. I've been mugged, but I've never had a gun to my head. You've I'm really been lucky. Mugged? Yeah, I got mugged. Well, the, yeah. the mugging was the most recent one. When was that? It was like two or three weeks after I started working at SourceFed. Shit! I got, and it wasn't even in LA, I was in Oxnard. Oxnard? Oxnard 805! Thank you. Um, I was gonna look to Owen to that, but thank you. Everybody knows, we're all yeah. well trained. Yeah. Um, no, I was I was in Oxnard, like near my sister's house, and I was like with, a, le, a, with a lady friend, and it was late at night. It's and disrespectful. We came Ricky, home. During his story. Um, <laughs> and it was a little late, and it was a little, it was, I don't know, it was just, it was it was next to a nice neighborhood, right. but there's, I don't know, there's just some parts of Oxnard, I don't know. And some it was parts dark, you just shouldn't go to. Oxnard, Wait. OPD or something. So mm-hmm. anyway, I was walking down, and then there was these three, these three, these three dudes. And we like, we're walking, like we're about to pass each other. So we walk, or there's two of us and these three dudes. So we walk and we pass him. And then one of them's like, oh, oh, hey man. And he starts like walking pat- toward me. He's like, hey, can I, uh, can I use your phone? I need to call my mom. <laughs> so, so then I was like, well, no, I'm not gonna let you have my phone to call your mom. I'm like, I'll call your mom like for you, like not yeah. even really thinking. I'm yeah, like, whatever. Like, what? And he was like, oh, okay, okay, okay. Give me <gasps> your fucking gun. <gasps> Give me a, so I was like, all right, okay. All right, man. Like kind of like I had been there before. It's awful. It's a horrible thing. Yeah, no shit. You've had that happen to you four And that's times? the fourth time. Well, twice was from like bad people, like vagrants, and the other two were cops. Oh, yeah. well, that's... Oh, wait, yeah, wait, yeah. what? Even so I was worse. like, oh, it's fine. Just, yeah, you put Ricky. me right at ease with that AR-15. Yeah, no, what the fuck? When, cops? why did they do that? Huh? Was it... Which story? Racist cops? Um, or was it actually, wrong no, no, place, no. wrong both, time both, cops? Both the police uh, incidents were wrong time, uh, wrong place, wrong time. One, okay. it was the last known address of the felon, which reminded me of the story because it was an apartment thing and they came into our apartment and my roommate answered the do- door in his Scooby-Doo underwear and it was, he greeted with an AR-15 Jesus. and then all the way down our stairs were like, Fucking SWAT, SWAT dudes, people. Because it was the last known address of some drug dealer, so we're like, Wait, so you used man. to live in like a wanted felon drug dealer's place? In Echo Park. Now, I don't know about you, Matt, yeah, but East. my worst roommate, <laughs> my worst I'm roommate. I'm alive, though. None of the yeah, guns no, are I'm really glad that I'm just, trying to, I'm just trying to pretend like my story comes even close to any of I yours. I feel like, 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 legitimately, like, we're smaller people than Rick. No, 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 like no, no, every no, no, no. second. <laughs> because you haven't faced death. Because we haven't <laughs> faced immediate death via gun. Because there's not been a gun in my face, I feel like I have lived less than Rick. Listen, I'm like smiling and laughing because that's how I cope with difficult situations, but that is not something to ever be wished upon anybody, and it was a horrifying, terrible thing, and I wish guns were... I have feelings about guns. Yeah, I am. That's understandable. uh, I thought I had feelings about guns, but you really do. It really puts it into perspective, a lot of the that kind of thing, when it's you're actually kind of faced with it. And it's like, oh shit, so, Yeah. yeah. The more you know. One time I had a Korean roommate and she would, <laughs> at nighttime, she would be awake talking on the phone all night to her family in Korea. And that was the worst I had it. Was it really? Like, <laughs> the worst you had? Oh, because it was That was the was worst, just, well. worst roommate situation I've ever had just because of the di- time difference. So she had to talk to her family at night and then during the day she s- would sleep. Okay. And then I would be on the phone with my family during the day. Uh, and that was pretty difficult for us. Like, real hard. Listen, guys, like, it was really hard for me, okay? Like, I feel like 
that sucks. I yeah, had like that's, a tra- you can't sleep. It was traumatizing. She's up all night. She's up all like, the time. Like you guys, I didn't have enough sleep. So no, I no. This reminds I me of get my educated. same house in Echo Park. At one time, it was a two bedroom. I had one bedroom, and in the other bedroom, at one point, it was my two roommates and both of their girlfriends moved in. So it was four people in one tiny room, and then me. Five. Yeah. Yeah, in a very small apartment. And listen, then Ricky, there was a lot of you didn't live in arguments. my experience. I did it. I was. Yours is nowhere near as difficult it, as mine. No, 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 no. <laughs> No. They were loud sometimes. It was inconvenient. I relate to you there. (laughs) What about you, Matt? I have a few to choose from. Wow, this is ornate. Yeah, I'm sorry. Oh, Denise made it for me. That's a little Buddha bracelet. A little digital zoom in on that. I'll hold it steady. Everyone's gonna make fun of me, but I love this. It's love. It's you in love. You're not ashamed of it. You're not ashamed of it. Yeah. God no, damn it. You have happiness, you have peace, you have love. There are people who long for that. Yes. Matt, I'm so lonely. You don't know what you have. It's Ricky, a wonderful, beautiful Ricky, thing. Ricky, Ricky. Am I joking? Ricky. I don't know. Ricky. You are so lovable, Ricky. <laughs> Which roommate do you want to hear about? Do you want to hear about the the Turkish guy who peed in the shower, or do you want to hear about the stoner and his girlfriend? Stoner and his girlfriend. Because peeing girlfriend. in the shower is just typical. Okay. You know, that's fun. Yeah. Uh, okay, so when I first moved to Los Angeles, uh, I was still finishing college, and I was in an apartment with three other guys, um, and I had a roommate who was the biggest pothead I've ever known, and I've known a f- my fair share. Did he have a volcano? Uh, he did not own a volcano because he did not have the money for one. Um, okay. His his girlfriend <laughs> was the daughter of a wealthy Korean tech magnate. Um, who went to college with us, and she was she was still at school while we were while we were doing this LA program, and he had an internship at Dimension Films, and he would go there in the morning, he'd sign in, and then drive home, get high, and like do some of his script coverage from home while smoking joints on our porch, then would drive back to Dimension before the end of the day, sign out. And then do it the same the same thing the next day, That's over and over and what over a again. Player. That's kind of cool. Any time that I was Way to play the that I would come home right. to that apartment, was there was either him or a friend of his, or later his girlfriend. And we'll get to that uh, smoking a joint on our porch. It was constant. At least they were on the porch, constant, it constant. sounds like. Yes. They didn't turn your apartment into an opium den. Mine would just be clouds. Me and Breeze would just be plumes. Plu- well, I don't know. What? I don't know what you're. Uh, pl- like yeah. I said, Ricky, our Casting experiences are so different. So different, right? Not that one. You don't, you'll yeah. never know what mine was like. I can't, I can't even um, keep a straight face anymore. So. <laughs> that was like such the most worthless uh, flip. Okay. So, okay, so spring break comes around. His girlfriend comes from uh, from Boston for the week. And they are in bed, rolling joints, sometimes even while having sex. Joints in bed? In while s- fucking? They- yeah, while fucking. They're a power oh couple. They're this sounds like my a dream, Hollywood actually. power couple. They spent in one... It, so she was supposed to stay for a week. Oh, yeah. She just decided oh, yeah. not to go home, oh, yeah. didn't tell her parents where she was, and then just stayed in my room with him for over a month. And in that month, they spent three grand on marijuana alone. Um, and well, that's a little much, but yeah. I mean, sounds but this guy, I just, I have bad vibes with him because he would borrow money and not pay it back. Oh. He would borrow mm. money and not pay it back, and it was like the day before we moved out, and he swore to me that a check was coming from his brother for $100 the next day, but his flight was today, and me, the fucking chump, gave him $100, no fucking letter, and still to this day, he denies that it ever happened. And that's what, Maybe and- he forgot. I'm sorry. No, he <laughs> fucking avoided me at graduation. Maybe he was he knows an exactly prince. why. He was not a Nigerian prince. He was like a six foot seven tall, just like weed machine. That's uh, oh well. He had a lot of body mass. He took right. a lot to fill his lungs to get properly right. inebriated. His girlfriend dropped out of college, decided to go to pho- photography school, and he moved up there with her. And she pays all his bills. And that's the last I've seen with him. Aww. She pays his. But bills. don't worry, he's gonna make films one day. Sounds like they're doing real well. Sounds, yeah, I'm, gl- I mean, I'm happy. Hollywood for that. power couple. And it sounds like you're doing well now. I'm doing fine. You're doing great. You guys are doing Thank great. You. You're we're, doing we're great, all Ricky. doing great. We're Aren't collectively such doing a great. Strange table. Oh, it is, but <laughs> it's fun. So much emotion. I never, I never get to do There's this. So I never get to do this, table. but we do. Just so you guys know, because we're 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 this is so the kind of the, the nuclear clique. Now we work together mm, very closely. Real closely. Yeah. We're making cinematic things. It's a lot of intense emotions. We're doing things. There's beautiful things, Bree. 
You're a beautiful princess. So are you. I don't so mind are you, saying Ricky. So. Oh, yeah. thank you. Yeah, you're Stop a chieftain. It. This Stop is such it. a love battle. Let's do I didn't do it. Let me get in here. Let me get in here. Get in get in there. I feel all warm and God, gosh yeah. darn it. Um, all right. <clears throat> uh, Heretic Child asks, at SourceFed Nerd, I currently have a roommate who keeps shaving his pubes in slash on his bed. Any annoying Ew. roommate stories? Wait a second. Somebody didn't launch this. Wait I, a second. Is that on? the same no, topic? No. There's no. There is no pube preface, though. But it was the same follow-up question. Did I... What? Mm. Let's, How let's, did that even happen? I feel like I'm in the fucking twilight I think, zone. Here's what I think. You need to you. shave your pubes over the toilet. You need to tell your roommate, get over the toilet, you straddle it like so, you get you a nice buzzer. Or like Not in the shower. And you in the in shower, there. no water on. You and really then you just scoop it up. You really gotta lift no, the under to make sure. scoop it up with sure. a paper towel or a vacuum. Wanna, you don't wanna nick the under. Oh, for God's you sake. Know, you, know what I'm, you know what I'm saying? The taint. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, the taint. The taint and its surrounding territories. You sure. don't wanna... Tainted like that. Here's what I think. I fuck think Ricky gets a chance to launch that and read a new question. Yeah. Boom. Boom. This is for you, Owen. I call this the wet willy. <laughs> Owen does Money. <gasps> oh, oh Owen's name. that was really close. <laughs> Owen's name. Um, all right. Uh, Jean Jacket with Jeans asks, uh. what's a website that was super helpful, useful just a few years ago, but is now completely obsolete? Example, my family used to use MapQuest for every road trip, but now everyone has GPS in their phones and cars, uh, so those printable instructions are obsolete. Club Penguin. What is Club Penguin? I don't know, it was a site that the kids I used to babysit would play. It's like the penguins they play. It's Club Penguins? Club was it just Penguins. like, it did you go to it? It was just a little animated head, thing. Guys. I have a really I dumb can't. one too. I have a real dumb one. Sickmyduck.com. Sickmyduck.com. Yeah, you can flip the letters around and it becomes something else. Anyway, if you Duck went there. Duckmysick.com. So it's about people dodging vomit. Precisely. Yeah. You nailed it. Mm -hmm. uh, it was just an animated gif of, remember back in the day when Madonna and Britney Spears like kissed at the yeah, VMAs? Yeah, yeah. It was just a loop of that animated gif over and over and over again. How is that obsolete? It's not there anymore. Okay. If you go to sickmyduck.com, I don't, I don't know if anything's there. Okay. Oh, I know. Ask Jeeves. Ask Jeeves. Ask Jeeves. Yeah. Alta, Alta Vista. Mm hmm Lycos. Yep. All the old Geo cities. Geo cities. Mm -hmm. I had Lyco. Yeah. Lots oh, you already said Lycos. Lycos search. Um, a little dog, a little black dog. What was the dog. one with fire? Is something the commercials? Fire? Ooh, Owen. If you could find me a Lycos commercial, the little dog. He was really quick and he was black and it was like a black lab and you run. He's like, he'll find you anything. Lycos. Go get it. <laughs> Unleash the new Lycos. I'll say Groove Shark. It was only a few years ago. Um, it was like pre-Spotify, like in 2010. It had every song on there, and you could just make playlists and just listen to anything. E-Bombs World. E-Bombs World. E -bombs. Oh, wait, I've heard about this. E-Bombs World's still up, I though. just heard about this recently. What, you, little... you had never heard of E-Bombs World? I don't think, no, I didn't. Oh, I'm gonna stick to it. it I'm not gonna back away to then make myself sound smarter. It was a pre-YouTube. Pre like a bunch of like, just like is. random shit would wind up there. That's how like things would go viral is on E-Bombs World. Fuck. Whoa, Ricky, that was yeah. not even Newgrounds. Sorry, that was I, I, close, People but... still, f I think, make things on Newgrounds, but it was like, I would go there to watch animations and play games. You sound like you're really stuck in the past. That was, can we help you? That was the question. No, 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 no. no. It a, like, look past it. Can we help you? Like forward Let's thinking. talk about it. Don't look back there. You see what's back there? Look back there. No, don't do that. Don't look That's back the there. past, you Matt. Look forward. This is you really frustrating. Forward. Matt, <laughs> like, we want you to open up and talk about. We just did our. We did a whole little nuclear, okay. a little orgy there. Sure, we're sure. In a safe space. Yeah. Tell us about that time in your life when it. Well, you we're, were out of time. We're oh, we're out of time. We're out of time, out of you, time guys. you guys. I want to thank Squarespace for sponsoring this episode of Table Talk. Goodness gracious, did they get bang for their buck? You should go to squarespacecom <laughs> talk and use the offer code TT for ten percent off gracious. your order. Squarespace, you should. Oh, really, you, should. you really should. You really should. Mm. Okay, uh, I'm Matt Lieberman. I'm Bui. I'm Ricky. And I hope you have a wonderful day. Me too. Don't look to the past. Don't look to the past, look to the future. future. Can we all do this on three? Can yeah. we all just do like that? Yeah. One, One, two, three. three. Future. Guys, just hold on, I got a killer playlist, okay? You guys like Coldplay and Creed doing covers and Nickelback, right? Say hello to Spotify Premium and say goodbye to ads. Probably should have gotten premium. Music.